you forge the new ring, you woke the bell. It cannot be allowed to reach the surface. These archers will not guard you for long, Orc. Why is it that humans always soil themselves as they die? I don't know. It's a right pain. I hate having to wash out my dinner before I can eat it. You shall abide.
arrived at the wrong place. But if you don't want to die, uh, I mean, if you want to die, I... Oh, this is the place you die. It's coming! <laughs> Boys, it's not for a fool. Yeah. Stop. 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 Stop
I believe this statue depicts Gladriel, an elf queen from a legendary forest beyond Gondor. I found scant reference to her in our books, but I know her name means Tree Maiden, and she's said to have hair of gold and silver. She was an elven monarch of the First Age. What wonders she must have seen when the world was so young. Did you know, Galen? Know her. She is an aunt of sorts. Suffice it to say, we did not always see eye to eye. Oh, no. oh, 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 o
Seeing a category won't eat. None is overrun with orcs, perfect for our purpose. Enough of your mouth, Bruce. So now I'm gonna kill you for all these orcs to see. Always said you were an optimist. Know what that is, mate? It's about sizing up a situation that's bloody impossible and saying, Yeah, all right, I'll have a go. I'm exactly the same way. to take me down! I wish I like to do anyway, so either way's a win. A fine addition to our army. Nice, Bruce. From your honor, I will be your shadow. No one gets to you without my say-so. Don't worry about my enemies. They will all follow eventually. You want to plant your flag in uh, Mordor, you'll need to do it deep. There's a fortress nearby. They say it's ruled by a two-headed troll big as a mountain. Deadly smart, which... Because he'd have to be given the two heads. You take him down, you'll send a message to Sauron, and get yourself some nice new digs as part of the bargain. I'm not going to do this alone. Gather your troops. We'll do. Ooh, just make sure you let me pop his heads off, won't ya? Weakening enemy power is important, but what is most crucial for conquest is strengthening our own forces. The Nazgul have surely tracked us here. They will find more than they bargained for. Unsheathe their weapons. 
This looks like Eltario's work. Well, she is indiscriminate. By the look of it, some of these would have made good followers. We must find her before she eliminates all our potential recruits. Though if she did, we'd have little need of an army. If you were looking for ring wraiths, you're too late. But before I engaged him, he was speaking to an orc who was... different than the others. There are worms nearby. Perhaps they can tell us what is going on. If we take them alive. You don't decide whom I let live, Ringmaker. You'd both do well to remember that. Why don't we just set their mounds on fire? Oh, oh, God! Unlike training, get you ready for war. Train you for it. Those herds! The Nazgul have dealings with special orcs. What are they? They're called the Chosen! I don't know what they're chosen for! Surrender to my command! Dirty tip! Why? Don't worry. I wonder what happened when we all broke down a goo hole. Did I just... What is the purpose of the Chosen? Secure the hide here! It's something to do with the seeing stone! That's all I know! Chosen, where do they come from? The Shriekers make them is some kind of ritual. All very secret. I don't know where. So long as the Witch King has the Palantir, any towers the Chosen hold will be his eyes. Then we must blind them. Ritual to create the Chosen. Where is it performed? No one knows. No one when knows. a captain selected, the Shrieker send a worm to tell him where to go. We must tell Otario what we know. This need not concern her. We have our mission and she has hers. Her mission is the destruction of the enemy that tracks us. The more information we share, the better. is using the Hydea to track the ring. They extend the Palantir's reach. Orcs call the Chosen Guard them. And the enemy may hold the Palantir, but the Hydea themselves are vulnerable. So, we know their design. And now we dismantle it.
The only imperfection in Nern is its orcs. Sauron's notion of perfection is a low, mean thing. Is this stuff? Right? This is our stuff. Stop it. You hear me? Stop it. Just stop it.
Witch King attempts to regain what was lost. He will succeed only in losing more. Make that bloke your bodyguard. Anyone looking to carve his way across Mordor needs a guard or two. I mean, I don't. Like, obviously. If it ever got to the point where I needed a hand on the battlefield, I'd, I'd cut my own throat. But you, you should have some added muscle. No shame in it. Once we have taken these towers, we should find Otario. She must know what is happening. She could be watching us right now. For the Witch King! For I am chosen! And you are filth!
presume to know what is in an elf's mind. Surely this Galadriel would seem the best. I don't question whether she is the best. Only whether she is the first. <laughs> Nothing will turn me from this mission! Oh, my God. 
are tenacious indeed, and as all are wise to create such powerful servants. However powerful the Chosen may be, the ritual to create them is where they will be weakest. Indeed. When the final tower is ours. With each tower we reclaim, the Witch King's vision diminishes. We will rob the Witch King of more than his vision.
be willing to destroy everything that has come before you. Even the memory of it must be purged. Do not think of what is lost. Think only of what will be. This is the She learned from Sauron as I did. She survived him. There is wisdom in these words. something that can swing a blade back at you. Your 
chosen. You are chosen. I have your back. And sleep! to follow. And I'll tell you what's always a popular one. Murder. Command that new follower of yours to gut some bugger you don't like, and that'll free you up to gut somebody else at the same time. And remember to keep the target's weaknesses in mind. If he's terrified of fire, there's nothing funnier than sending someone to clobber him with a fire weapon. Oh, that's proper music, that is.
don't think you are threat. I think you are tasty morsel, too small to be full meal bard. Interesting little tidbit. Mm. You are delicacy. <sighs> This ore comes from a longboat that washed ashore in the Bay of Belfalis, and it surely passed through many a Corsair's hands before finding its way inland, where I espied it atop a merchant's cart years ago. I have often wondered about the hands that rode it to sea. Were they the calloused hands of a slave, or those of a dashing Corsair of Umbar? I suppose I'll never know. What use has an oar away from his boat? And so far from the sea. To remind people that Middle-earth exists beyond the bounds of Mordor.
We are flying! Sauron's domain is now much smaller. You're right. <gasps> 
wouldn't have treated you right. Not like I'm gonna treat you. <laughs> him bodyguard to a war chief so he can well stab him in the back of course no war chief's gonna take on a bodyguard unless he's proved himself and the place to do that is in the fight pits how does surviving a few rounds make you trustworthy no idea but it's a bloody good laugh and you'd be a drongo to trust an orc anyway so it all works out go on have a go
My first drill instructor told me, trust in your training, not your armor. Even a finely wrought plate can buckle under a hard enough blow, but a skilled warrior can evade that blow so it never lands in the first place. Now Minisethil has buckled under. Some blows are impossible to evade, so we do the next best thing. Stand back up again, wounded as we are. This armor is intended to be ceremonial, yet it seems sturdy enough. As it should be. Gondor has little need for ceremony of late. I'll kill you! Just get closer! Make me slaughter! Gondorians are a seafaring people. Though our ships ply the coastlines and rivers, rarely venturing into the open sea. Yet it was not always so. Our ancestors, the Numenorians, and their elven allies sailed to other lands in ships like this model. Sailors even claim it's possible to sail so far into the ocean that land is too distant to see in any direction. Hard to imagine. So I suppose I'll have to see it for myself someday. Did the elves truly sail in vessels such as these? In the First Age, this would count among the most ordinary ships in our fleet.
army is ready. Then it is time to take the fortress of Nan. <laughs> Actually, I don't know a single word. Anguish is a pain in the ass, but to hazard a guess, he said we're all gonna die horribly. Uh, my kind of black. Well, I will handle the Overlord. You focus on the defenders. Define focus. Maybe I'll pick up a sword for myself. I could use a new toothpick. <laughs> pick your teeth later. Right now we need to take the fort. Ah, right oh, boss. I'll chew my way right through it. To this fort capturing business. <laughs> and once this one's yours, you'll need a new overlord. I'd like to throw my hat in that ring. His potential is nearly unlimited. Righto. Now I'll snuff the overlord for you. Killing the overlord will set. This fort 
belongs to the Bright Lord now! Uh-huh. Can't hear anything in this. <laughs> I thought I recognized that voice. Right back. So much to catch up on. Where do I start? How about your death? What? You mean getting hit by the hammer? There's a headache at most. I mean, you want to kill a Nuruk, you gotta take the head clean off. Does the job every time. Well, most of the time, I think. I don't know. Never really been sure about that. Oh, I'm quite sure it's all the time. Allow me to demonstrate. Bruce. Welcome. The man is a friend. The Olog, watch him. Make sure he don't do anything suspicious, like, you know, kill me. How did you end up here? Well, I was captured by some slavers, actually. They weren't all slavers. Two were cannibals, one was a necromancer. A fun bunch. They captured this Olog. Oh, he was in rough shape. We were cage mates until I sprung us out of there. Olog jumps out, arms go a flying, and then here we are, the best of friends. Muronam <laughs> Kirinu Rachanuk. Oh, right. I should tell him about the fort thing. Thank you for that. It's kind of a long story. Ranger killed the old overlord. Now it's ours. Ranger? Oh, yeah. I named him after you. I'm on it. Well, it's been nice catching up in all of it. Bright Lord of me just came by to tell you that the fort's ours now. Bright Lord? Well, you are welcome to it, Bright Lord. Me and Ranger are done with the Overlord game. It's a right pain. You gotta feed your followers, train your followers, make sure you don't get killed by your followers. Yeah, it's a right bother. Ooh, well, your worries are over. Because now I'm over. No. Uh-uh. No, 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 not you. Anybody but you. Whatever you need, Ranger. Me and Ranger have got you covered. Wait, Ranger, Ranger. Yeah, it's a little confusing, isn't it? But the point is, Bruce cannot be overlooked. Zupakin. I'm not working for these two. I'll tell you that right now. That works out perfectly. Because we got no current openings for half of oh, these squabbling fools. They have their uses. You bear must choose our overlord with care. Maybe you read my mind. I am a mighty vicious. What? Olog's friend.
Now we have a foothold in Mordor. We should upgrade our defenses before Sauron attempts to reclaim what he has lost. And there are more fortresses to conquer, and the Palantir is back in Minas Morgul. We must choose our next move carefully. Almost forgot to tell you one last thing. Now that you have my thought, it will eventually come under attack. Which you already know since you attacked it once yourself. Nicely done, by the way. But the thing is, you don't always need to be on the defense. You have scouts who can sniff out enemy forts so you can go on the attack yourself. You know what they say, the best offense is a good offense. And don't worry about running low on orcs. If you ever need new recruits, you go talk to a glob they call the Headhunter. He'll sort you out. Oh, Shrock! I forgot to fill Ranger's feeding bowl before I left. Oh, he's gonna be cranky if I don't get back. I'm coming, Ranger! Ranger!